Hello, I'm Carla the Fobbit, and I just wanted to take a moment to thank you for clicking on this video and also to ask another question. I got a really good response to the question of whether or not I should continue after my death, so I wanted to try another one. It has been pointed out to me that my horde base looks like an owl and I see it very, very clearly now, and I'll never be able to unsee it. But I'm okay with that because owls are awesome. They can turn those heads all around and see everything. I think it's fitting. But now, if you have a base that looks like an owl, I feel like you should name the base. Now, I have some names in mind, but I thought that I would get some opinions and once we get a name, then we'll figure out the paint scheme. So, I'm going to leave it up to you. Give me some suggestions. Let's see what we can come up with. And we'll wait to paint until we know what our base is called. Once again, thanks for watching. And I hope that you enjoy this video. Y'all have a great night. Oh, nope, did not want to fall down with them. New, 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 and I am tired. This is what got us in trouble last time. That's okay, run, 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 run. You're fine, you're fine. Hello, I'm Carla the Fobbit, and welcome back to Seven Days. Once again, not really a major plan because it seems like every time I have a plan for a day, it doesn't really work out. For example, still no beaker, and no stun baton. So once again, we're going to wing it and see what happens. First thing we're going to do is hit this cleared infested area. Then I think maybe we'll try to explore and see. Ah, uh, that's just a dead tree. I thought I saw sand out there. That's just a piece of dead tree right there. Anyway, then we're going to see if we can maybe find the desert. Um... Worst case scenario, we hit the cold and maybe pick up some things from there. So, I did realize when I was editing the last video that Pine Coney had suggested that I just do the bar down there, but I thought, well, let's double up this. So, this may work. And it may not work. So we're going to test it before we make it solid. I may be able to hit the zombies through it. And it also, if I can hit them through it, maybe it'll help protect me a little bit. So we'll test it before we make it solid. But anyway, that's going to be a later Carla problem. I spent a couple of hours getting a couple things done, got our horde base warning sign up there. I thought it would be perfect because this is eventually going to become our parking area. I will put a ramp in here and a ramp in on this side so we can drive in and out on both sides. And we will park up here and then on the inside because at the last video I could not remember who gave me the idea to support those bars. So here we go. It's just better if I don't butcher your name by trying to pronounce it. And then Pineconey, of course, gave me the suggestion of doubling up those bars at the bottom of the horde base. Sorry, like you know, by now, words, they do not come easy. Anyway, let's not waste away this day. Let us begin. First, let's see if we get what we get out of Moe's electronics truck. Stun baton. Stun baton. No stun baton. But I do want to look at one thing before we go in. Now that we've got a few more books. Yo, know, two more books. That is exactly where we were the last time I looked at this. All right, an infested area, and I am by myself. So let's just take it easy and see if we can come out of this one alive. We can do the clear, and then we can worry about looting. 
course, I don't like the idea of not looting while I'm clearing. Because what if I get a stun baton and can use it? All right. Um, let's back up a little bit. Because there's a lot of them in there. Close the door. Or... Oh! Well, that didn't last very long, did it? He just brought his own little self right on through there. Wow, how rude. Alright, let's crouch down. Didn't do as much good before, but we'll try again. Ooh. A lot of red dots. Let's try to take these one at a time. I don't see anybody running yet. So we're all right. Wow, wow, wow. That's whew, that's a lot of Tims. A lot of Tims. The good news is I did put one more point in the couple of hours that I spent doing some things. I put one more point into heavy armor to help out with our stamps a little bit more. And then I also made level one iron chest and leg armor because those were my weakest things. We had the mats to make more, but I just don't see any point in making level one unless it's going to do us a lot of good. And it did make a difference in our leg and our chest because I think we had tier two and tier four respectively. I think all of these guys came out already. Did I see an arm in there? Or I thought I saw something come out of there. Imagining things. That's what this game will do to you. It drives me nuts to go buy loot. It really does. Nice and quiet. Ease on in. Another maze like the one that we went through yesterday. Ah, oh, I remember this because if I go in here, those guys are going to fall down on my head. Oh, let's just get them all up. All right, let's bring them through so that we can take them on one at a time. Kind of like a horde base. Hopefully they, they, they can't come in behind me now. So far, so good. All right. We are taking this the smart way. Let's see if we can get a little closer and maybe... No? Come on. Over here, guys. I really would love it if you came over here. I don't want to fire a weapon and make that kind of noise. <laughs> well, that was a delayed reaction. He kind of... Oop, miss. Kind of took that in and then flipped over backwards. Well, let's get a little closer. Uh, all right, well. Give away our position because we can't play with these guys anymore. And he's still got it. Get back down. How rude. Let's go on in. So we've been through here before, I believe on the search for the stun baton. See if we can do a sneaky shot on this guy. Or, it's completely missed. Oh no! Oh crap! Stupid! Did I get them all? Oh, I don't have time for that phone. Oh, my phone just scared me. Holy cow, thank goodness for making some better armor. Let's heal up. Where's the last thing? I hear something. Oh. 
Hopefully it's just a zombie. I'd much rather it be a zombie than another stupid featherless pigeon. Alright, let me go ahead and harvest these so at least they were worth the trouble. I know there's a zombie in here. I just don't know where he is. Aha! There's two in here. Let's go on out. Let them come to us. Oh! <laughs> there was maybe... One or two more than two in there. All right, one more. All the Tims. There go. Had them lined up. Now I wish I was specting shotgun. So let's make us a path now. Make, you know what? I'm just going to take a peek, make sure nobody's coming up behind us, because that would be bad. Try to use that as an escape route, and then we get bombarded from behind. Here we go. Try to be a little sneaky. No. Oh, eradicated. Oh, this is what happened last time. And last time I realized I should have taken them out. Run again, run again. Come on. Please go down. Please go down. Don't get too far away. I'm still good. I'm in the green. Alright, everything's good for now. For now. Uh, I think that's my only eradicated, thankfully. I do not see a feral. See, we learn from our mistakes. We should have kited them out instead of trying to fight them in such a small space when I died. Whew. Yeah, I, I talk a lot when I get nervous. Holy cow. All right, so that was the end. But yeah, see, I did learn from past mistakes. Kite them out. Give yourself some room to run and scream. A lot of room for screaming. All right, so we've looted up everything else. We are out here to the main loot now. So let's see what we got. And infested clear, so let's see if it was worth it. Go ahead and scrunch that down. I also ran out to the mini bike and dropped off everything that I could so we'd have space for this. Let's see. So far, nothing to write home about. And here's the infested cache, so let's check that out. Bunker Buster mod. That's not bad. We'll go ahead and throw that on now. I'd say that really, the only thing I'm happy about getting is this Bunker Buster mod. Ah, uh, tier three infested, and hmm. let's go see what we get for this. Yeah, I've got everything on me that I want to sell. Let's run in here and see Jen. Does it seem like to anybody else that our days just fly by way too fast? Hello, oh, Jen. Wow, I didn't think you had it in you. Good job. Oh, look at that. Some steel knuckles, but I'm using a baton. I am specced up in batons. Okay, anyway. I'll take the steel pickaxe. That'll be very useful. Let me see your inventory so I can sell you all the stuff and things I have on me. And... She reset... Today, I believe. So let's take a look and see what she has for us. Let's stick this steel pickaxe on us. Run over here. Do we have a sugar butt? Of course we don't have a sugar butt. Why would we have a sugar butt? Huh. Well, we're going to buy it anyway, with or without the sugar butt. Alright, Jen. I want to see your inventory and what we are going to do. Because we need better everything. 
right here. She's got a level two AK. That is now ours. Because it is a decent amount better than our level two pipe machine gun. What do we got left? $794. We're just going to sit on that for right now. I hope you come back and see me sometime. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hit the wrong button. What jobs do you have? Restore power, clear zombies, infested. We're going to go for infested. If you do this for me, I, I had a good feeling about you. Good luck. It's 1552. You know what? We have time to do this infested clear. Um, uh, I know that we need to go exploring. Need to find some sand. Just dump everything in here. Except for you, my dear. Because you are going to go on to me. What? Frog. There we go. We, we, we just needed that. There. You get in there. You, my dear, load up. Alright, let's go hit this infested clear. And see what we can get out of it. Not too late, so I should have time to ease my way through it. I think we'll be alright. So here we are at the Ingalls residence. Clearly, Little House on the Prairie. Um, if anybody's not familiar with that, good, wholesome family fun. Oh, well, let's go ahead and get rid of you. Anybody else hanging around here? I don't see anybody else. Let's get in here and um, hopefully get something good. Climbing a rope. That's good, because I prefer to come in from the top so that things aren't falling down on our heads. Let's try to be a little stealthy. Or not. Ew, ew, ew. So let's see. A ladder down. Can we see anything? Besides a noose. That is very, very... Unreassuring. Alright, down we go. And eradicated already. Alright. This this is fine. Oh, this is, this is not as fine as I'd like it to be. Let's go ahead and not play. Where's the eradicated? Get rid of you. Nobody needs a spider coming up behind them. Let's do this the smart way. Huh. Would really... Let's see if I can shoot him from behind from this ladder. Woo! Well, that, that did some crazy things. There we go. No, dude, right over my head. Come on. They never do what you want them to do, do they? Ever. Oh, nope, did not want to fall down with them. New, no, new, no, new, no, new, no, new, no, new, no, new, no. and I am tired. This is what got us in trouble last time. That's okay, run, 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 run. You're fine, you're fine. No, don't die again. Don't die again. Come on, take him out. Take him out. They're all eradicated. Holy cow, don't get too far away. Don't get too far away. All right, all right. Oh my god. Really? Let's just take a moment and, and breathe deeply. Get some of our health back. 
As a matter of fact, let's make a little visit over here to the mini bike. Make sure we're in the clear. Pull out a weapon just in case. And reload. I don't know if I have enough ammo for this. The other one was was yeah. Well, no, we're not. We're not leaving. Goodness, I should have brought some more ammo. Apparently, all right. We need one of these and one of these <laughs> and one of these. There we go. All right. I wasn't scared. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> ah. Maybe I was a little because she scared me. So that's two zombies I've seen off in the distance. I don't want anything stinking up behind me. So here's the deal. I need some ammo. So I am actually going to do some looting as we go. I know we don't have a lot of time, but, well, maybe I shouldn't be doing this. Maybe just looting. But I'm hoping to find some ammo while I'm in here. So what's in here? Ooh. We're just going to go ahead and scrap you because I can make more. Nice, motor tool parts. That's, that's a good find. Here we go again. I really had it in my mind that this place was going to be easier than it is. Pretty hiding back here, right? Here we go. Let's try some stealthy little moves. And the door is locked, so we won't be able to use it. Right. Did the Ingles have a dog? You know, I'm kind of thinking that they did. Yes, they did. A little scruffy looking thing. So I wonder if these Ingles have a dog. I really like the way it's set up, though, with the little shutters on the window. Oh, main loot. Great. Spider. And for some reason, I get one, one sneak kill and everybody wakes up. All right, that's good. That's good. I know the other guys have to be up there. Hmm, he's running. He's running. And this is not going to do me much good, is it? All right. Crawly dude. Take you down. Wow, this dude's moving. And that's not the end, so let's go ahead and reload. There's still more joy yet to come. Let's go back into sneaking. So far, it's it's helping some. I mean, every zombie that I can get out without dying is, is a plus. Oh, oh, they're all up there. They're all up there. Oop, here they come. All right, let's see what's coming out after us. Oh, everybody wants to run. He's not dead. All right, let's save ammo. Coming from the front of the house, too. Oh, he got a hit in. Owie. Owie, owie. Somebody lost their head. Arlene. Uh, I don't see any more red dots. All right. Whew. So, if I take it slow, I can survive these infested clears. What would make it better is if I got better stuff. I just need, we need better everything. Ooh, better everything. All right, you know what? Let's get straight into the good stuff and then I'll loot the rest on my own. Unless I find something good. Well, I guess the good stuff 
Baton parts? I need those. Look, there's the ammo I needed. It's all here after the fact. A crack a book? I, I'm not going to complain about that. Ooh, structural brace mod. Right now, let's see. Modify. We could definitely use you there. I mean, you're not doing that bad, but the pickaxe is probably the best place for it when I'm mining. Working stiff. All right. All right. This is a good box. With disappointing contents. That was the main loot. Let me just loot up the rest of this really quickly. And then I'll bring you back in. But before I, I let you out. Let me just say. Actually really, really cool. This is, this is pretty much what it looked like. I don't remember this back room. But this front room where they came in and they ate at the table and cooked right there. Awesome. I love it. Nighttime is upon us and I'm still finishing up this loot. But I just wanted to point out that I don't ever remember Charles Ingalls having a minivan. Alright, since it was nighttime and I had nothing else to do, I left no stone unturned there. So now we head back to the base. Quick swing by Jen's to pick up all of the odds and ends I left in the chest. Hopefully I can fit it all. And then... Maybe there'll be a zombie nearby and I can test that horde base and do some more solidifying. I didn't find a whole lot of, of cobble today, but maybe a little bit. And I picked up as much wood as I could. Alright, now that I've got a couple things stashed away and emptied myself out a little bit. Where did I see? I saw Edgar running around down here. So I wanted to get his attention if I can find him. There he is. Let's see if we can get his attention. There we go. So let's see if we can hit him through this hole. Hello, dude. Yes, we can. There are a lot more zombies hanging around. So I may play with them some more. Also put away this stuff. Maybe do some upgrading. So. I won't keep y'all hanging around forever. Thanks for stopping in. Thanks for watching to the end. And I will see you next time. Have a great night.